So we've created a tool to replace the online donation button, as we've seen three main opportunities in online fundraising today. Our tool increases donation rates, increases the number of donors that become repeat donors, as well as the overall number of eyes visiting your site. And we do this in three main ways. First, we show the need right in the, point, right at, in the donation tool. And we allow the, the donor to essentially vote with their donation as to what's most important to them. Second, we create, a we create communication between the donor and the recipient based around what it is that the organization is, uh, what the donor is actually interested in. And third, we encourage and, and measure the effectiveness of viral promotion. And we do all of this in a simple tool that can help reduce overhead while still providing all of these benefits. In the 2008 study, a majority of donors indicated that they needed to see a clear use for their money before they would decide whether or not to donate to an organization online. And yet only 4% of organizations were showing this to their donors on their homepage, with donors claiming it was typically hard to find that information. We have a solution. What you see here is the website of one of our most recent clients, Harlem Live. They're an organization that teaches high-tech journalism to Harlem youth. Our tool is right over here. So let's zoom in a little bit. As you can see, they've listed different initiatives that they're raising funds for, including their video journalism program and support for their weekly web magazine. And in a different uh, use case for this, they've also used our tool to collect donations for uh, specific items and equipment needs that they have. So your donation would go directly to a new video camera or new video editing software that they need as they expand their program. But what's most important here is that this is right where the donation is made. So rather than the donor having to see somewhere else on the website what the, the, the use for their money is and have to remember that when they make their donation, they're seeing this transparency right here, right when they're deciding how much to give. And this is what's really helping in, improve donation rates. There's also one added benefit, which is that donors are giving instant feedback to the organization as to what projects they're really interested in. And this, can, this data can help organizations in a number of ways, including um, you know, how they're, what they're going to emphasize as they're marketing uh, their, their different programs to their donors. And now that we have donors supporting specific programs, we also are going to be, it's much easier to create donors into repeat donors. The targeted messages are extremely powerful. The ASPCA found that with, uh, just by targeting their, their messages based on a donor's animal preference, so by sending a dog email to a dog lover and a cat email to a cat lover, they were able to triple their response rates. And in another study, uh, a research organization found that the average online donation can be increased from $57 to $149 just by targeting messages. So three times the number of people are responding, and on average they're donating three times as much. With GiveLoop, we display every donation in a donation feed. It's very familiar Facebook wall style. And this encourages communication between the donor and the recipient based around what it is that the donor is actually supporting. It's also very helpful because it's giving the organization a very simple, easy way to update donors as to the progress and completion of the items that they've donated to. And this is to all the donors who have supported a specific project. This becomes a great time to start asking donors for repeat donations later on. So we have donors more engaged in a program and supporting specific projects. This also means that we can, we can start uh, more easily converting them into promoters of an organization's work. So immediately after a donation, we ask them to share information on Facebook and Twitter. And we can track and record this, uh, the, the overall in, uh, effectiveness of that donation. So we can see how, of that, sorry, that, that promotion. So we can see exactly how much their network was able to raise on behalf of the organization. Also, with just one line of code, anyone can embed a widget like this on their own personal website or blog. So if I were to write an article about an organization, I can start to collect money for them right at the bottom of that, that blog entry. And this is when, when donors really are, are, when readers are most interested in the program, right after they've read the article. So again. We're increasing donation rates, we're increasing the number of repeat donors, as well as the, uh, the overall number of interested eyes on your website. And we do that by showing the, the direct need right in the, the application itself, by uh, creating conversation between the donor and the recipient based around what it is that the donor's interested in, and by uh, encouraging and recording 
viral prom the effectiveness of viral promotion. But we realize that there's one more important thing for this to be a really useful tool, and that's that it needs to be simple. Simple to set up and simple to use. Right now, visiting our website, you can create a campaign in a number of seconds, and you can install it and have it fully integrated into your website within about two minutes with just one line of code. And the tool itself is just as easy to use. We'll be doing live demos uh, of the tool after all of these presentations, so we strongly encourage you to come and check it out and see it uh, live in person. We also feel it's extremely important to have organizations be able to just try out the tool. And so we have no setup costs and no subscription costs, because if you're not making money, neither should we. At the moment, we're charging a 5% transaction fee, which we're clearly presenting to the donor. So for the organization to receive a uh, $20 donation, we're going to need to charge your credit card $21. So far, 91% of donors have, absor have opted to absorb this cost, which means that organizations are currently only paying us one-sixth of 1% 1 of the total funds that they raise. We're also really excited about this market. Nonprofit donations last year in the, uh, uh, online were $12 billion. And um, because we're not a nonprofit company, and we're, we're targeting a much larger question about uh, improvements in online donations, just adding the, um, the market for political donations is adding an additional $4 billion this election cycle. Both numbers have been uh, steadily growing year after year. So we launched a few weeks ago. We currently have 16 clients ranging from nonprofits to politicians to bloggers, and we are generating revenue. Our next major milestone is to reach uh, $100,000 in, in um, generated uh, donations for our clients, and this reaches us to a point of profitability. So if you're interested in what we're doing, please um, come, come see us after, uh, the, after all these presentations so we can show it to you in person. We know there are a number of investors in the audience, and we'd love to meet with you and start up a conversation that might lead to a financing opportunity later on as we expand our growth strategy. Um, and also, if any of you know of any individuals or organizations that might benefit from this tool, please consider getting them in touch with us so that we can uh, help them raise more funds and connect better with their donor base.